Yo, what's going on, Sexy Seven Letter Squad? Today we're doing ranked 1v1s. It's Try Hard Thursday, so we're going to be try harding on Thursday. And um, I decided I'm not going to ban anything all day today. I'm just not. I'm just going to pass all my bans all day. And whoever we fight, we fight. That's just how it's going to work today. Is it good? Almost, most definitely not. Most definitely not. However, it could be fun. Uh, I am going to go Bluestone into Jotun's probably, just because mana seems important for me. Also, I haven't played Uller in so long. I always first ban him, so this is going to be one hell of an opening match. But we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Jesus. Precision. Accuracy. <laughs> Destruction. Oh, thank God. Okay. That was a little bit risky because I didn't know if my uh, meditation would actually give me enough mana to use all my abilities. And he had mannequins, so there's no way I ever win that fight if I don't get all of those abilities off. Thankfully, <clears throat> meditation came in clutch and helped me out. Got me the kill. Very important for me. Very important. I will say the only thing I dislike about Uller early game is how much mana he uses. And I feel like maybe I should have... Oh, right here. I feel like maybe I should have just started blue buff instead. What are the odds he kills me? Well, 100% if I hit nothing. He's got alt, which is scary. Yeah. Okay. It is most certainly not my game right now. I am missing almost everything. Somehow I still have a kill because when I when it was important I actually clutched up and got the kill. But uh that's about all I've done so far. I hit the I think I hit one axe, maybe two axes. As long as I keep this lead, I should be okay. I don't need to be perfect. I just need to be manageable. Um, I really want to get in there. Oh, nice. I actually hit that three. Very good. Very good. Now, obviously, this is going to be up. I'm going to back because he'll murder me. I'm also going to grab, I think, tier two breastplate here over getting any kind of tier four item. Because I, I do want Jotun's, but I think 
hitting max cooldown right out the gate is actually pretty nice with Uller. So I think I will do that. Okay. I wonder, do I win these fights? If I see it. Not if he is alt up again. Oh my god. I didn't even see him walk over there, and I had a ward there, and I saw minions. And I didn't even see him over there. And he just pops out over the corner and alts me. Damn it. That's so horrible. Whatever. At least it lets me stick to my word of wanting blue buff, actually. <sighs> I didn't even hit that. Do the exact same build right now. Me and him. What does my alt do? The attack speed and bow stance. Mm. Oh man, I actually hit my my um well everything actually actually hit everything but it wasn't enough to kill i do wonder if bluestone would be better i doubt it but maybe the odds don't favor you. Don't stack them. i'm getting tier 4 breastplate here cuz it's going to give me uh 85 protection rather than 65. Um, you don't win these, do you? Mm. Does he win those? Oh my god. I swear to god, holy shit. Um, <sighs> I don't know. Maybe I just never fight. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm just done fighting. Because I cannot do anything. Today. I'm brain dead. I'm actually brain dead. What I should do is just stop fighting altogether and just wait. Today would be a great day to play Heimdall. If all I do is AFK, because that's all Heimdall does. Just sit under your tower and you wait. Probably doing Bull Demon. Oh, he's there. Let's 
feel like my damage is so bad. Honestly, I have no, no idea what I'm doing. Is Crusher even good on Uller? I feel like Crusher is good as a... Okay. As a generalized item, but is it good on Uller? Why do you go beat stick? Okay, I had a ghost hit on that axe. everything. No kill. No kill. Alright. But, even though I didn't kill him, that was probably one of the first actual positive fights we've had all game. So, I'll take it. I'll take it. As for my item, I kind of want Aussie, but I don't have I don't have any anti heal, and he does have anti heal. So if we both go Aussie here, it's gonna feel like he's better off than I am. Hmm. <sighs> he does have his alt up right now. I'm hoping he back. I think he backed. I don't see him. Oh, there we go. Okay. He did go Aussie. I myself am going to get that Aussie. I kind of feel like I might should just go Xy instead, though. But I'm not going to. I'm not going to. Oh, Bull Demon, huh? Man, that beat stick and that regen doing so good for him.
Ah, uh, he's got too much healing, man. He's got too much healing. Can I maybe stop him? Okay, holy. What an incredible fight. I had to focus so much, I don't think I said a word for like a minute and a half. That was, that was not an easy one to win. Can I win the game off of it? No, I don't have the minions for it. But I get the Phoenix. Do get the Phoenix. I'm being a little bit greedy here, but it should be okay. He's going Transcendence last item. I'm going Toxic Blade last item. Because he's getting a lot of regen. I don't know... I don't know whose is better, because Transcendence, obviously, he's going to be doing a lot of damage. He's just back throwing the tower off. Alright. All right, he went for the kill, and I came in with the the uh, the backwards cap, the the Chad play. I said, you know what? You're gonna go for the kill. I'm gonna go into axe stance, stun you, and punch you in the head with axes until eventually either one of us dies. Thankfully, he died. <laughs> GG. All right, that was game one. I'll see you guys in game two. Welcome back to game number two. What's interesting about this game is that it's Sukiyomi versus Neath, and neither of us banned any gods. So uh, I was fully expecting to fight Uller. Turns out, no, nobody. I mean, neither of us banned gods. So, what a very odd game. What a very odd game. Like if if two people did full bans, you might expect a game like this. Maybe, you know, you'd be like, ah. Neath is open, and they, they like Neath, whatever. But with no bans, you got, like, so many good ADCs to choose from. You got Izanami, you got Uller, you got AMC, you got Hoi-Yi. You got all these characters you could pick from, and he still goes Neath. As for my Tsukuyumi, I just really like playing him. Which is why I'm playing him. <laughs> Alright, that was good damage. I went Warrior's Axe start. That is odd. I lose the 1v1 right here, right? Warrior's Axe is strong. Oh, unless you missed that. Tell me you, you don't have backflip. Oh, he does that backflip. Oh, I thought maybe, I thought maybe that could last hit. Oh God, it's sustain. I actually can't stop him. You watch out. 
Hmm. Okay. You know what? Fair play. Nemesis with Warrior's Axe has immaculate sustain. I I couldn't I couldn't do the the red buff. You just healed too much. All right. I will say do not lazy back here cuz I will kill you. Oh, he's not. Okay. Man, he ran all the way back. Honestly, as long as I get this blue buff, I think I'll, I'm okay with taking that trade. Taking the uh, red buff for, for both blue buffs trade. It's a weird trade to take, but he also missed out on, um, on a lot of minion XP too. So I think I am okay with it. And the fact that I bought some mana potions... So I can spam all these abilities and still have decent clear and stuff. Your middle tower is under attack. I am not being thought. I never Okay. I didn't think that he would just let me walk him down. I figured there would be something there but maybe when he missed his one he just kind of knew that he was dead because i was waiting for his aegis i was gonna alt him and uh and he just the aegis just never came man i don't know the aegis just never came all right back grab the rune forged i'll grab a chalice and a blue pot I'm a little bit far ahead right now. I'm not far ahead. I mean, I'm I'm 600 gold ahead, which isn't insane, but I am only up one kill, so it's not bad for one kill. I don't think he wins this fight. Nice. Okay. All right, all right. I do have to be a little bit more careful, actually, about his um, his two that he does, because it's very easy for me to forget how bad that attack speed slow is. It's like a thirty percent attack speed slow or something ridiculous. So if he drops that two on me in the middle of a fight, and I still kind of keep my aggression. That could go very poorly for me. My one is chunking. I'm just being really aggressive right now because I want to... I want him to back a little bit later so that I get a free red buff. With no contesting. Because even though he uh, started Warrior Axe, I mean, his one is still going to do... Two to three hundred damage to that buff. And he does have transcendence now. So I can't laugh at his damage anymore. Although he can't laugh at mine either. My god. I kinda wanna ult him. I'll ult him if this one hits. He did hit. Nice. Cool kids don't look at explosions. He died to the three and then hit the surrender. Nice. That was a good game. I enjoyed that one. Oh. All right. Off to game number three, boys. All right, boys. Another session. Another of no bans. He did ban some stuff. He banned some pretty good gods. But, um... I didn't ban anything. He picked Athena. Okay. So what's happening here is I think... People see that I'm not banning anything, and they that immediately makes them think that I'm trolling. But I'm not trolling. And I, dude, I was about to say something that makes me sound like a two-year-old. I was about to say, treat me like an adult. What day is today? 
Uh, best of my knowledge, my knowledge, it's a Tuesday. You're safe. All right. I really got to poop. Just so we're all aware. Just so, just throwing that out there, making sure everyone knows what's good. I don't think you win this fight. Okay. You do have Boomba's Hammer, but I have just so much more sustain than you. And much better clear. You do have way better buff damage than I do, but I'm going to go ahead and say that won't matter if you can't get here in time for the buff. And I was right. Perfect. We Aegis. All right, he definitely wants his blue buff. Not getting it? I guess because he knows I want it. He knows that I would definitely invade that blue if he was on it. I mean, I invaded it anyways, but... He would have died also. All right, let's see. Please don't come steal this. My damage isn't that good yet. Nice. I got it. I am maxing the two. The reason being is I just want to be able to clear. I'll win. I feel like I'll win the fight anyways, so I don't need to max the one. If I just max the two, then I'm chilling. Oh god. Nice. Very nice. Good kill, boy. Um Honestly, I'm going to just sell that and I'm going to go like What can I build with 2200 damage? Yeah, I'll just go. You know what? I'll just go Yotens. I'm cool with this. I'm cool with going Yotens. A little bit of cooldown never hurt anyone. Other than the enemies of the people who build cooldown. Oh. Holy damage. Yeah! Oh, I really thought that would hit. Did he just ward his tower, by the way, or did I not see that correct? I'm pretty sure he has a ward right there. Should I buy a sentry to clear it? Now that would be troll. Oh god! Um, let's just go Crusher. Dude, you would never guess, other than maybe the first game, this is game three. You would never guess that I didn't ban anyone. I fought AMC, which is the one time you would assume that I, I didn't ban anything. And then I fought uh, Neath and Athena. What the heck? Oh, hello. Hello. My damage, man. You got Book of Thought. I mean, a max damage Athena can be scary. Don't get me wrong. Like, if, I, if anyone knows about scary, scary builds, it's me. Because I've done just everything. No? You're better than me? Damn it. Oh! <laughs> nice. Good job, dude. Good job. Oh! 
the archers targeted him. The archers targeted him. The archers targeted because he killed me. Oh my god. Oh, what a troll sequence of events. I dive Phoenix. I dive Phoenix, miss my two and die. And then he dies to minions after revenge killing me for, for diving his Phoenix. What an insane sequence of events. All right, I'm, I will take this. My HP is lacking. I need some, some help. My HP is lacking. And I need assistance. I wonder if I can alt him while he's charging his dash and then his dash won't go off and then I kill him. What do you think? You think you can outrun me? Oh, I missed. Oh, he's so low, dude. He's so low, dude. All right, let's take about half of the Phoenix and dip the fuck out of here. <laughs> Leave me alone. All right. Grab this. Potions. Head back. By the way, I haven't said this today. Obviously, it's, you know, I'm a dude who I wear my heart on my sleeve sometimes for detriments. And being a content creator does make it slightly a detriment because it's very obvious to know when I'm not in the best mood possible. Um, But, yeah, I apologize for less of a happy mood and more of a try-hard mood. I know it is try-hard Thursday. But I still like to keep, like, a sense of kind of, like, fun lightheartedness in all of my videos, even if I am tryharding. And today, the sense is just, like, I'm a tryhard dork. Reason being, because I got shit on in my first game of the day today. And, uh, and it made me feel pretty bad about myself, to be honest, so... So you guys are going to see the, uh, the try hard version of today and the less whole. Oh my God. Yeah, 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 yeah. You don't scare me. You don't scare me. You don't scare me. The enemy thinks they're being sneaky, eh? Let's play hide and seek. Nice. Um. But yeah, so you guys are seeing the tryharded aspect of this. This video. And less the... I'm playing good gods, but also like... Lightheartedness. But what I will say... Is my 24 hour stream is tomorrow. And I am super, super, super excited for it. I cannot stop thinking about it. It's going to be so much fun. And, uh, you know, I, I don't know if it's going to be a good thing or a bad thing. But that bunny outfit, that Playboy bunny outfit, if we hit that certain goal, is just... <laughs> Revealing is an understatement. I am going to have to wear pants. Not pants, but I'm going to have to wear gym shorts with it. Just so I don't get banned. <laughs> You know, so I got to cover my ass a little bit, but literally cover my ass a little bit. I don't know. I don't know if some people might have thought that was like, uh, he's, he's got to cover his ass as in make sure that I don't get banned. Like, don't get the second aspect of it. But no, I, like literally I need to cover my ass because it shows I'm double cheeked up in that thing. So, um, not to mention, it's it's so small, I feel like a ball might slip out if I don't wear gym shorts. So I gotta be a little careful. 
but uh yeah no it's i'm so excited it's gonna be so much fun crit 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 oh man sorry we do damage please don't ouch i need nasi or something I feel like I need an Aussie. <clears throat> By the way, I think I mentioned my 20... I, I talked about my 24-hour stream and how I'm excited for it, but I didn't mention when it was. Is some I know for a fact some people only watch Try Hard Thursday because they don't like all the meme shit on other days, which is totally acceptable. I understand it. Because I, myself, like watching people doing their best. I mean, I like watching memes too, obviously, but... More so, I like watching people doing their best. Um, so, if you are one of those people that only watch this Tryhard Thursday, welcome. Today, I have to tell you that on Friday, aka tomorrow, um, at 6 p.m. Eastern, I am doing a 24-hour live stream on my Twitch channel. I'll put the links of uh, one of the incentives for donating during the stream and two of the... Um, actual twitch stream itself so you don't have to go on a little easter egg hunt to go find it you got divine which is fine but also like i really don't have that much healing oof There's a lot of damage to me. You know what I will say? If he gets level 20, this game could... I could actually lose this game. <laughs> Believe it or not. He is level 15 right now, so... Him getting to level 20 is a bit... Of a long shot. But if he does do it... I bet this is good for I'm telling you, dude. Don't underestimate him. <laughs> Boomba's Hammer Athena is correct. Is cracked. I just realized I'm like nearly three thousand gold ahead of him. Can't catch me. Where is he? Oh, he was he was warding. Boom! 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 Look at that damage, man. I missed. Oh no, I couldn't. He got me. He got me, dude. I win the game. Thank you, fire minions. But he got me, dude. Wait, do I not win? Yo, I don't think I win. Hold on. Hands up. He saved it. That's so pog, dude. <laughs> I can't believe he saved it. That's sick. Also, why doesn't he have a second relic yet? He could just get blink and try to one shot me. Back to me. <laughs> Yo, he had, he had no idea I was next to him, dude. He had no idea. He was so scared, I bet, because I just walked up right next to him when, he, when I was stealth. Oh my god, that was probably so scary for him. Holy crap. 
<laughs> That's so funny. Alright. GG, my dude. Alright, there's gonna be a little bit of a gap between this game and my next game because I gotta poop. Um. But for you, it'll only be a couple seconds. So I'll see you guys in game number four. Five. I played... Who do I play? I, I play. I played... Uller Souk is an army. So I'll see you guys in game number four. Yo, what's up, boys? Game number four. We're fighting a Kali today. That's not a bad pick. It's a pretty solid pick. I think I want to go Gilded Arrow. Oh, no. Mannequin Scepter is better because she's a physical god. Mannequin Scepter is better versus a physical god because it has protections that can help you live through the burst. A uh, fun fact. Actually, it's not a fun fact. It's a fact that's quite upsetting. Um, people in my comments, like I said, I read every comment. Um, and there was one guy that was like, Sam, why the hell would we comment when you don't ever like our comments or read them? I read every single one. I'm sorry I don't like like them. I'm mainly on my secondary YouTube account called Hyperman. <laughs> Maybe I'll start replying as Hyperman and you guys will know it's me. I don't know. But, um... Either way, uh, I saw some comments saying, Hey Sam, I come to watch you play Smite. I don't really care about your singing or your humming or your beatboxing or whatever. Uh, honestly, next time you do that, I'm probably just going to unsub. Uh, good riddance. I hope you never come back. I don't want people like you in my community. People in my community are cool people. You seem like you're not very fun at parties. So, just want to say that real quick. Let him know that I've outgrown pettiness. I'm done with it. If you try to threaten me by saying I need to stop doing something I enjoy doing, then you can get all the way away from me. I don't care. That's just, that's just my life, man. That's just my life. That's just how it works. That being said... Let's get back to the game. I am just farming. I have Mannequin Scepter. Probably late game will be a little bit tough, but I think it'll be okay. I'm hoping, at least. I do a lot of damage. I'm going first item Bancroft instead of first item Ring of Hakate. I don't know which one's better, but I feel like when I go against these um, physical assassins, like these melee assassins, I like going Bancroft more just because... It lets me really stay in pocket with them a bit more. Dino mannequins, yeah. You gotta ult that, my guy. You gotta ult that. He jumped away so he wouldn't have to ult, but uh The mannequins tick was coming in too hot. Now he does have ult this time. Um Dude, my my burst is just it's too good. It's too with it. You know what I mean? Too with it. I don't want to use an ability because I don't want to give him an opening. All right, he doesn't have blink. He doesn't have blink. So I'm pretty sure I'm safe here. What he could have done was jumped the he could have jumped to the back line. And then threw his two to stop my back. But I don't think it really would have mattered too much. Because he is really low HP. Obviously I probably wouldn't win the fight. But I would get away. I, I'm, I'm pretty sure. I don't think he would kill me. So he'd be risking a lot for a little. But we'll see. I have full Bancrofts now. So he might be getting aggressive on me. Now that, uh, now that he's back with his finished item. I wouldn't be surprised if he gets a little bit aggressive. But, um, I don't know. With full Bancrofts, I'm going to be healing quite a bit. So I'm pretty safe. I'm going to slowly backpedal. Clear this wave with my one. Or not my one, I'm sorry. My auto attacks. So that I can just keep up this really solid tower push. Oh, he was not expecting the burst. I think this guy keeps, uh... 
His problem is just that he wants to get like the perfect ult, right? Like what people don't understand a lot of times when they see players like this that just like, oh, you have ult up. Why don't you use it? It's because they're waiting for like the perfect opportunity. They're waiting till they're like five HP and they can ult and like super bait you. Um, but unfortunately for them, it's very easy to bait, you know, your perfect ult because my burst damage is so much, like I said right there, my burst damage is so much higher than you think it is. So like when I hit you with an auto, the second that my two lands, it's, it's bursting more damage than you, you would expect. You know, you're either expecting the auto hit to hit or the two to hit, but not both of them. And when they both hit at the same time, you're just so caught off guard that you just die with your alt up. It's unfortunate, but it definitely happens. It even happens to me. And I've played a lot of Kali in my day. A lot of it. All right, good clear. I'm pretty sure he does not win any fight against me right now. You just got to back it up and back it out. He's over there. All right. I don't have any mana. It's all back. I lied. I'm not backing. <laughs> <clears throat> Um, I unironically think I win a fight without any abilities. Like, I think I can win this fight with just autos. Oh. All right. Never mind, man. Prove me wrong. Get on my Cheerios. Well played. Not upset. You just played it well. I'm going to go sprint. Meditation would be good too, but sprint is fine. Meditation would be good. A uh, horrific would be good. Sprint would be good. Aegis or beads would be good. There's a lot of great options for this matchup, but I'm just going to go with the very generic sprint. The reason I thought I would win that fight, by the way, is because I assumed he wasn't putting points into his ult. So his ult was going to last two seconds flat, but I think he is putting points in. And so his ult lasted three seconds, which actually surprised me a little bit. So let's go. I got the minion for the, the uh, back door protection off. And red buff here. He tried to fight me, but I guess he didn't know that when I died, I had so much golden hand. I could just buy a full mid guardian. I hadn't backed in quite some time. Yeah, his damage is really low. He has what? He has 60 power? That's not going to do anything. Nice. Blue buff is mine. Alright. Alright. Fine. I'm going to bait this because I know he warded it. What I'm doing is I'm baiting this because I know he uh, he warded it and I just want him to lose the entire minion wave, which I made him do. Oh, I might be dead here. Not that here. Oh, he's doing my blue buff. He went to go do my blue. That's so funny. Um. I should be good to get this Phoenix. Mid Guardian is just doing so much for me, man. 
Mid Guardian is just doing so much for me, dude. Oh god. You have cooldown? If you have alt up, I die here. You don't. Nice. Nice. No alt up. He dies. He surrenders. And we, as Alpha Chads with 3,500 gold, move on to game number five. Hopefully, a good game. But we'll see. We'll see you in game number five. What up, gamer brains? Let's, over with. Let's game. Let's game. Are waiting. I passed all my bids again. We're playing Hoi. I'll switch up the scale a little. Is Chongo here yet? Is Chongo here yet? Swift 4195. All right, Swift. Being deeply loved by someone keeps hmm. Let's do this. Honestly, I kind of just want to go Gilded Arrow. Like, Mannequins is great. Mannequins is great, and I love it. And it's, like I said, fantastic and stuff. But I just kind of want to go Gilded Arrow because I love the damage that it gives you on everything. 25 basic attack damage is great as a hunter. It's fantastic as a hunter. Nice. Very, very, very nice. That was a close game. Close fight. They almost lost it. The red buff acquired. I kind of want to fight. Don't win this fight, right? In fact, I don't even think you get close to winning this fight. Oh, that was so close, dude. That was so close. That actually hit him, bro. That actually hit him. Oh, tell me that kills. It doesn't kill? No way. I can't believe that ult didn't kill. Blood is not about possession. I cannot believe that ult didn't kill. But that's okay, because we are four, we're 500 gold ahead. We're 500 gold ahead. I hopefully will have triple buff control here. Assuming he doesn't steal this, which he's not in position to. Which is great for me. So we have triple buff control and uh i'm level six he's still level four i'm feeling real good right now he is gonna get five and maybe try to fight me but if i just run i should be fine right i'm just gonna focus on uh farming up rather than kind of poking him down Damn, my auto hits for 104 on him. This is my basic auto. That chunks. Oh, I thought that would bounce off. Dude, my damage is so good right now. He popped his med, but I don't think he can compete for this buff. Wait, I'm trying to bait him into ulting me. 
I was hoping he would get a little bit cocky. Go for the alt. Unfortunately for me, he didn't. Alright. Let's just back here. I'll get my transcendence online. Don't do it. His blue buff would like to get. Now, I will not have my alt for this fight, but I will have my shell. All right, he's 100% going to try to ult me here. Oh, okay. That was really close. <laughs> I messed up that fight really bad. It was much closer than it should have been. But that's okay, because at the end of the day, we still won the fight. This. This. And I don't want to be too greedy. I don't want to be too greedy with them. I kind of wanted to go for the next wave too, but... At 400 HP, like... A stray auto attack could kill me at that point. It's just not worth it. Ah, uh, jumping in is bad decision. He is stunned. I don't think you win this fight, do you? You definitely do not. In fact, my ricochet actually double hit you for 813 damage. That's insane. His ult is down, so I don't need to be scared of anything, really. I can just casually clear this wave. In fact, I'll jump on the back line there. Mm, I will say he gets red buff. It's never fun. really thought that was about to hit, dude. That would have been nice. Oh, he probably has alt up soon. Oh, God. No! Oh! <laughs> Let's go, dude. Let's go. I thought I fucked that up too bad. I thought I fucked it up. Something fierce that I would die, but... Oh, dude. That was so... That was so greedy for no reason, honestly. 
That was so greedy for no reason. I had to jump his ult. I had to knock him up out of his two. Me missing my one was pretty much death for me. I'm so glad he missed. Almost so glad he missed. Tough. I could go Toxic Blade. He does a Meditation and Soul Eater. I don't know. With Aussie and Chalice, I'm pretty sure I can just tank through any wave right now. In fact, I'm pretty sure I could just tank through him right now. Yep. Yeah, with Aussie and all this HP 5 regen and stuff, not even to mention the defense I have, like, I just... Nothing he can do. He is not feeling too hot right now, for sure. Let's just do Bull Demon. It's gonna be very slow, but... Whatever. Where you at, buddy? that which is very bad but Aussies you, you got my back you got my back Aussie thanks man thanks Aussie you a real one all right that's Phoenix down hopefully I uh my minion damage is not too hot. That being said, I do have 33. Never mind. I have 34, 50 gold right now. In hand. So I could definitely get some more damage. Uh, all right. He's too fast for me. Blue buff down. This down. I wonder if I could get like 10,000 gold in hand. That would be crazy. I feel like I couldn't. I don't know. Nice. That was close. I really thought that he was just going to ult for the CC immunity. Because I I figured he knew that if he ulted me, he died there. But I guess there's always that chance that I mess up and he kills me. And 5,500 gold in hand when we won this game. I wonder if the Titan gives you any gold when you win. I guess not. Because it didn't. Five, 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 nine golden hand. That's ridiculous. What a way to end the video. Holy crap. Again, I apologize for a little bit more try hardness and a little bit less lightheartedness. I, you know, like I said, have not had the best day on smite today. So, um, you know, 
I apologize for that, but sometimes it's just how it be, man. Sometimes it's just how it be. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys.